When should you close your swimming pool for the winter season? Well, it kind of depends on how you use your pool and who you use your pool or who uses your pool. In a lot of the areas that I worked, uh, the swimming season kind of follows kids in school. When kids get out of school for the year, open the pool up and they go swimming. And once they go back to school, nobody really uses the pool anymore. You know, it's getting cool at that time of year and it costs more to heat the pool. So you close it down. There's in most areas, you know, it depends on where you live, but in most areas, there's going to be a, a sweet spot that you're aiming for when it's not really hot enough to swim anymore unless you're really into swimming or you pay big bucks to heat your water. So your water is kind of too cold to go swimming, but all the leaves are still on the trees. That's kind of the big thing. Once the leaves start falling and drying up and blowing around, they definitely accumulate in swimming pools and you can make an awful lot of work for yourself by deciding to close two weeks later as opposed to two weeks earlier. So that's definitely something to consider. And people who have owned swimming pools for a long time in seasonal areas where you close for the winter, they'll be able to tell you that. You definitely want to get the cover on the pool ahead of the time that all of the leaves fall and start blowing around. Now there is something to consider as well, which is mesh safety covers or mesh winter covers for swimming pools. They're a little bit of a different animal in that they're not an isolation cover. They do stop physical debris from going into the water, but they do allow water to go through. As a result, you can end up in a situation where you peel back one of these mesh covers in the springtime and the pool is absolutely day glow green. So even if you have the pool nice and clean and chemically balanced at the time of closing, you could still end up with this crazy green water come springtime. What do you do about that? Well, the main thing you do is, just as I said, you clean your pool, you balance your chemistry directly before you close. But if you have a mesh safety cover and you live in a seasonal climate, then what you probably want to do is aim to close your pool later than most people tend to close their pools. Likewise, you want to open your pool a little bit earlier than most people open their pools. And if you kind of adopt that mindset with your with a mesh safety cover, or mesh winter cover, in that you kind of want the pool closed for the minimum amount of time, then you're going to be a lot less likely to have that brilliant green water come springtime. Otherwise, those mesh winter covers are a pretty good solution and a very popular one at that. If you found this information helpful, please be sure to like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And you can check out my website, swimmingpoolsteve.com.